it is Saturday afternoon. It's 2.40. We're in the Ikea parking lot. We're about to go in and get a full-length mirror at Ikea. I don't know if we're going to do like a full walkthrough. I think you can kind of skip it and not walk through the whole thing and just kind of go to the end. But we also don't know what aisle the mirror's on. If you know what I'm talking about, in the end there's all those aisles with where certain things are and they're labeled throughout the walkthrough where it is in the main area. And Christian's holding the camera, so I'm sorry for it wobbling. But anyways, we're gonna go inside and do that and get our full length mirror. We have been dying to get one, so we're finally getting it. Come on, you have to help me. What, what, yeah, it's just this one piece? Yeah, I think so. <laughs> we'll just lift it up and slide the TV stand underneath it. Is it just one box? Yeah, that's all. The mirror's already together. Oh, this is the mirror. Yeah. Oh, I thought this was the TV stand. Yeah, <laughs> no, this is the mirror. This thing is yeah. massive, honey. It's massive. That's what I wanted. chance to talk to you guys today um we went to ikea and then we walked around the mall because ikea is right next to the mall and then we drove home we got a mirror and a new tv stand i will obviously show you guys what we got but um we've been talking about getting a full length mirror and getting a new tv stand because the tv stand is actually like a shelf it's not even like a tv stand you can use it as a tv stand like the one that we have here so this is the tv tv stand that we have currently we just i never wanted to fill this with stuff because i didn't want it to look cluttered so i'll show you the tv stand that we ended up getting it's from ikea so it's not expensive and here is the mirror it's a huge mirror we're gonna take down our christmas tree and i think we're gonna put it on this wall right here um because we don't really have any other spot to put it i mean depending on how big the tv stand is we could put it over here in that corner We'll see, but um, yeah, this is sadly going down. I'm really sad about it because I loved having it lit and on. And then I got this basket that we're gonna put on the right side of the TV stand. I'm gonna remove these brown handles. I'm just gonna cut them and then we'll put it right here and put blankets on it. So that's what we got. But anyways, um, Christian's bringing up the other part of the TV stand um yeah we haven't really been doing much today we went to ikea and went to the mall and that's about it we had like a late start to the day we didn't end up eating lunch until like 2 30. then we went to ikea and you know that's like a whole process you're walking around looking at stuff and then you grab your stuff in the end and then we went to the mall walked around we didn't get anything from the mall and then we drove back home it's six o'clock now so i think i'm gonna end up putting the mirror right where the tree is and but i would want to take down the tree first that's like another thing but um anyways yeah that's what's going on today and then we're like thinking about what to do for dinner so i didn't realize how big this mirror is it's actually massive i wonder how fun taking it on the tree is going to be hmm. well i also got i got my ring cleaned so we went to this ring's from David Dearman Christian got it for me. We got it cleaned while we were at the mall, which is like such a game changer when you wear like the David Dearman jewelry every day. It starts to turn a little bit. Not like turn, but get kind of like, doesn't look as shiny as it could. You have David Dearman jewelry 
they clean the jewelry for free so I just take it when I go to the mall and I'm wearing it so yeah that's what's going on Here is the mirror. It's really big. Um, when I would see it in people's videos or I saw it on TikTok a few times, I'm not an avid TikToker, but I was influenced with this water bottle from TikTok the few times that I saw it on there. I just got it off of Amazon. It's always sold out in this color and other colors. The only ones that are really available are like pink and blue. I would have gotten the white one, but this one was in stock, so I just got it in black. And I like it. Am I on time? Yeah, I'm on time. <laughs> but um, I think it'd be really good for work. People make fun of me at work for my big 42 ounce Hydro Flask. And, and all I can say is they have not seen anything yet because this is, I think, 60 ounces. 62 ounces. It's 54 here, and you can fill it up to the top. So I think that's like 62. going if you can hear that in the background but we're about to start building the TV stand kind of looks like a little complicated okay this is the progress we have made we've just built <laughs> well Christian has mainly built <laughs> two drawers um, this is a disaster but yeah this is how far we've come basically Ikea threw up in the living room so here is how the TV stand turned out and we got this basket yesterday too and we threw the blanket that we were using as the tree skirt in there. So this is what it looks like. I still need to clean this mirror. I put on like the littlest bit of concealer and then bronzer and then mascara and eyebrows. We're going to Trader Joe's to stock up on some stuff and I need to clean this mirror. But, um, and then come back and do laundry. 
haul. Um, we just got back from Trader Joe's. The line was longer today than it usually is on a Saturday afternoon. But we just got some of the stuff that um, we go about once a month. And just stock up on a bunch of frozen stuff. I have done so many Trader Joe's hauls in the past on my channel. So if you want to see what we get, definitely check out those videos. So we got something new. We got a few new things, but this is one of them that I'm going to recommend. It's really good. We also got um, sweet potato crackers. This is good with them. But I was eating them with these Simple Mills sun-dried tomato base and basil crackers. And it was so good. And these are really good crackers with healthy ingredients. As you can see. But really good with this dip. This dip is going to go really fast. We got Chipotle for dinner. Someone's coming to pick up the old TV stand um, in like 20 minutes. And I love having Chipotle on Sundays because I can take the other half for lunch. And that bottle is out to remind me to wipe off the counters. I'm also behind on drinking my water. I need to be almost here. And where is it? Oh my gosh, it's way up here. The rice is good today. Yeah. Okay, we just finished eating Chipotle and the guy came to pick up that um, TV stand. Now we're about to start, we're about to not start, we've already started it. We're about to watch The Mandalorian. If you haven't seen it, it's pretty good. I don't really like Star Wars or anything like that. I did like Game of Thrones. Are we on episode five? Yeah. We're on episode five of it and it's really good. Um, Baby Yoda or the child is so cute. We're like obsessed with that character. It's so cute. Probably watch one or two episodes and then I'll shower and get ready for bed. This is why we are obsessed. <laughs> Look at that face. I don't even know why that is so cute, but it's so cute. Okay, I just got out of the shower and we got these brownie and cookie um, dessert things. So we're gonna try those and then I'm gonna wash it down. We ate out all weekend. So <laughs> I'm gonna wash it down with a ginger shot after. Trader Joe's has some of the best ginger shots.